Hello, my name is Heidi Brown and I'm a urogynecologist in San Diego, California. Our paper in IJCP is a study of the impact of fecal incontinence or accidental bowel leakage on quality of life. The Mature Women's Health Study was an internet survey of over 5,000 U.S. women 45 years and older to identify prevalence and impact of fecal incontinence. We found that over 1,000 women, 19%, suffered with fecal incontinence at least once in the past year, and that 9% suffered with fecal incontinence at least monthly in the past year. Over 70% of women with fecal incontinence preferred the term accidental bowel leakage, or ABL, to the more commonly used medical terms of fecal or bowel incontinence. Our featured article details impact of accidental bowel leakage on women's quality of life. Little has previously been known about the impact of ABL on emotional well-being, perspectives, and coping. Despite its significant negative impact on quality of life, previously reported rates of care seeking have been low, ranging from 8 to 27 percent. In our sample of 938 women with ABL for whom quality of life data were available, nearly 40 percent reported a severe impact on quality of life and many endorsed symptoms of wishing to get one's normal life back or feeling frequently depressed, indicating a negative impact on emotional well-being as well. Despite such suffering, fewer than 30% had sought care from a physician. One of the most striking of our findings was that more than half of women who sought care did so with their primary care physician, or PCP. This statistic motivated our desire to communicate these data to the IJCP readership since PCPs are the gateway to connect these women with treatment and resources. Additional information about prevalence and predictors of accidental bowel leakage can be found in our companion manuscript in this issue of IJCP. Thank you.